<sighs> okay, what's up guys? Today we're gonna be doing, you guessed it, another variation on the Manhattan. Um, this one though is a reverse Manhattan. All right, so let's just get into it and get stirring. First thing we're gonna need is two ounces of a sweet vermouth, then one ounce of rye, and then two dashes of Angostura bitters. Put them in there, give it a good stir, uh, whip out your Nick and Nora or your coupe, whichever glass you feel like, pour it in. We're gonna garnish it off with a brandied cherry, and then boom, guys, boom. We have ourselves a reverse Manhattan, all right? And it's like, this is one of those drinks where you really, really need to make sure that you are using a, a, a vermouth that you enjoy. Pick one you really like. I use this one from Avril Creek. Um, one, I, I love this stuff. It's absolutely delicious. Um, I went with this, my go-to rye from Okanagan Spirits again. Like I said in every other video I use this stuff in. Um, it just works really well with vermouth, uh, sweet vermouth, okay? And then Angostura bitters. The reverse Manhattan, it it simply is uh, reversing the ratios, right? Uh, your standard Manhattan will be two to one rye to sweet vermouth. This reverses that. It's two to one sweet vermouth, one rye. Uh, so Justin Lavenu is the co-owner and operator of the Roosevelt Room in Austin. Uh, he says that if this cocktail in a lot of ways is basically just like an homage to the way that people used to drink vermouth. Okay, so back in the 1800s, like the mid to late 1800s, people used to drink vermouth like quite a lot. Like right now we're quite conservative with it. Like we don't, we don't use a whole lot of it in our cocktails. Uh, back in the 1800s, they'd be just pouring. Like, right, they love their vermouth. So that's why this would be an homage to that because it's, it's heavy on a vermouth and it's delicious that way, right? Um, but anyways, guys, that's all that I have for you today. All right, just a nice quick one as always. Um, give this one a go. I do recommend trying it uh, and definitely pick a vermouth you guys like. Please do. Uh, it's very, very important to enjoying this cocktail. But anyways, I will see you next week. Thanks for watching. Uh, let me know what you think about in the comments. Uh, if you have a cocktail you think I should be making, let's hear it, all right? Let me see. Cheers guys, keep stirring.